What's up guys, PG here, hope you have a wonderful day. Today I'm gonna to give you the three best penny stocks to buy now while the market is in the red. You know that when the market is in the red, it's a great time to buy, it's a great time to go shopping, and that's what we're gonna to do today. Before I talk about the stock, be sure to subscribe, turn on the post notifications on so you don't miss any videos, and let's jump right into it. The first best penny stock to buy now is IQSTEL, ticker symbol IQST. The price of the stock is currently at $1.3 a share. One month ago, the stock was at $0.3 a share, so the stock quadrupled in one month, which is really impressive. They gained 320% in one month, which is really great news. If you're not familiar with IQST, they're a communication service company who offers services going from 5G to blockchain payment. I really like the blockchain payment part because that's the future. A good price to buy IQST is around $1.35, $1.40 a share. Yesterday was a red day, so the stock went from $1.69 to $1.38. So $1.35 to $1.40 is a good price range because I can see this one go to $3 a share in the next couple of weeks without a problem. So this one will double in the next couple of weeks. Now in the worst case scenario, if the stocks continue to dip and goes to $1.10 to $0.90 a share, that's the danger zone. That's a zone you don't want to be in and you don't want to invest when it's at $0.90. That's the danger zone. The buy zone is around 1.35, 1.40, and keep this one till it goes to 250 to 3 because I can see this one double. The second best penny stock to buy now is Alpine 4 Technologies, sticker symbol ALPP. They're currently selling at $6.4 a share. One month ago, the stock was at $3 a share, so the stock doubled in one month. Some really impressive gains. If you're not familiar with ALPP, they're a company who provides drones to the public, to the military. Recently, they signed a deal with the military to have drones, and we know that drones are the future, so that's a really great sign to invest in them. A good price to buy ALPP is around 6, so right now is the perfect time to buy. If you look one week ago, the stock was at 7, so we've been in a dip since last week, and that's a great time to buy, because if you look one month ago, if you look at the graph of one month, we can see that we had a, a dip at end of January, then we had a big spike, then we have a new dip, so we can only expect to see a big spike. And my price prediction, I can see this one go to 20 easily in a couple of months, 25 to 30 in a two to three months. So this one you can double or triple your money without a problem, even quadruple even. A danger zone for LPP is around two to three dollars a share. So if you see the stock continues to dip and if the stock goes to three dollars a share, you don't want to get in, that's the danger zone, that's the zone you want to avoid at all costs. The third and last best penny stock to buy now is Citrus Pharmaceuticals, sticker symbol CTXR. The price of the stock is currently at 154. One month ago, the stock was at 119. So we're early in this stock. This stock hasn't exploded yet. So right now is the perfect time to jump in. If you're not familiar with CTXR, they're a biotech company who creates cancer care products. A good price to buy CTXR is 1.35, $1.40 a share. In my opinion, this one can go to 280 to $3 a share in the next couple of weeks, maybe one or two months without a problem. So $1.35, $1.40 a share is a really good price to get it. The danger zone is around 1.10, 1.20. If this one goes down to 1.10, that's the danger zone. That's the zone you don't want to be in. You don't want to invest if the stock is at $1.10 a share, $1.15. That's the danger zone. That's high risk. Now let me tell you why I invested in those three penny stocks today. The first thing to look at before buying a stock, the revenue. So let's look at the revenue for IQST. The revenue in 2018 for IQST was $13.78 million. In 2019, $18 million. Some nice growth, good sign to invest. Their Q1 revenue is 5 million, their Q2 11, Q3 13, so they almost tripled their revenue from Q1 to Q3, really great sign to invest. The annual revenue for ALPP in 2018, they had 14 million dollars, 2019, 28 million dollars, so they doubled the revenue from 2018 to 2019, really great sign. Q1 was $8 million, Q2 $9 million, Q3 8.73. They lost a little bit, but together they have some great revenue. If you look at 8 plus 8 plus 8, if Q4 they have also 8, that's a really great sign to invest. Great revenue, $32 million, they increased. The revenue for CTXR was not reported on my app, so we'll have to take a deeper look. If we take a look, if big investor invested in IQST, we can see that on 21 January 2021, Alpha Capital Unstalt bought 2.3 million shares. That's a great sign. A big fund bought 2.3 million shares, that's a great sign to make money, that's a sign that the stock price will go up. If we take a look, if big investor invested in ALPP, we can see here that Chang Richard bought 10 million shares, Bataglini Richard bought 20 million shares, but that was in 2015 and 2016, so they were really quick, they were really early on the occasion. 
does that mean that the stock is over, that it's too late to make money? In my opinion, no. That's just a great confirmation that people believed in it, but two to three to five years ago. In my opinion, we're early on ALPP and they will become leaders in their industry without a problem. The CEO is part of Tesla, was an ex-employee of Tesla. So they have a great team, they have a great CEO. And in my opinion, ALPP bec will become the, f the leaders of the drone industry. And lastly here, we can see big investors who invested in CTXR. And we can see that they have big investors, Vanguard Group, Hightower, Virgin Financials. They also have some big mutual funds, Vanguard Total Stock, Fidelity. That's some great news. They have some big funds. They have some big investors investing in them. That means that there is a great opportunity to make some money. The only downside is that we don't know the revenue. It's hard to find the revenue online. So that can be a red flag. But if we see that big investors, big funds have invested thousands of hundreds thousands of shares in the company, that can be a great sign. If we look at the demand for the ALPP stock on Google Trends, we can see that one week ago there was a big spike. Two to three days ago was again a big spike, yesterday a big spike, and today there's a new big spike coming. So people are still searching for ALPP and people will still buy it, so the price will continue to rise. If we look at the demand for IQST, we can see big spikes today, yesterday, and two days ago. So that means that people are looking at the stock right now and, they're, and that they're buying the stock right now. So this one has a big spike coming today. That's the great news. The price will go up. And if you look at the CTXR stock, we can see a big spike today. Right now it's going down a little bit, but the biggest spike of the week was today. So that means that people bought the stock and that will buy the stock today. That also means that the price will rise. Now, if we compare the demand of those three stocks to see which one is surged the most, we can see that the most surge is CTXR with the biggest spike yesterday. The spike is just enormous. The demand is almost triple as big for CTXR as it is for IQST and LPP. We can see that the second biggest one is ALPP and the last one is IQST. So the biggest demand for the stock is in CTXR. The question of the day comes from Bob Bob who says, can you please look at IQST? I feel it is the best OTC stock that I've ever come across. They look extremely good and they just announced their debt free since yesterday. Today they announced that they have a big agreement. Financials are also very good. Please look into IQST if you can. I would love your thoughts on it before anything, please. The question comes at the perfect time with this video. I had a plan to talk about IQST for a couple of days. And when I saw the question yesterday, I said, let me put this one in the video and talk about IQST because like I said, they're a great company and I can see also this one double or triple in revenue. I can see this one double or triple their stock price in a couple of weeks without a problem. We've seen that they have some great growth in their revenue over the years. We've seen that they have some big investors investing in them end of January, which can be a sign that other ones will join. And if we have big funds and big investors joining in March, in April, that can be a great sign that the stock can do X10 without a problem. And the two points that Bob Bob talked about the question is also a great sign to invest. They are debt free. That's a great sign. And they just did a partnership to work on EV batteries. So EV batteries will be a big focus in three to five years. So that's going to be a great sign to keep the stock for three to five years. And if the partnership is successful and they become successful in creating EV batteries with lithium, that can be a great sign to invest and keep them for three to five years because EV vehicles, EV batteries will be a big focus in the next couple of years. It's already right now, but in 2025, it will just explode. So that's also a great reason to invest. They're working on EV batteries. I also saw that they're working on blockchain. So blockchain with Bitcoin will also be the future. So they have some two great parts of the future, EV batteries, blockchain, even 5G. So all around, they're a great company. So the three best penny stocks to buy now are CTXR. There is a big demand for the stock. They have big investors investing in them. They're a part of the biotech industry, so they will play a big part in the future. Great reasons to invest. The second best penny stock to buy today is ALPP. They have great revenue. They have two big investors that invested millions of shares. They are the leaders in their industry, so three great reasons to invest in them. And the third best penny stock to buy today, IQST. They have some impressive revenue. There is a big demand. They have some big investors investing in them. If some more investors can come in, that would be the perfect scenario. Remember to try to buy those three stocks when there's a dip. Yesterday was a red day. So if today is again a red day, that would be a great time to buy those three stocks. Next week, we'll probably see some green days. So you can already make some great money. Remember to take your profits. If you make 50 to 60% gains with those penny stocks, cut your losses if you lose 15 to 20%. And if for any of those stocks, you can see them being a big part of 2025 to 2030. Keep them for the long term, because like we talked about, some can become big players in the future and some can just go with the times. So whatever feels best for you. Remember that everything I said in this video is for entertainment purposes only. I hope you enjoyed this video. Leave a like, subscribe, and I'll see you tomorrow.